Good morning children. Today we shall learn how to compare rational numbers. We can compare the integers very easily. Here we have the integers on a number line. The value increases as we go from left to right. Like minus 7 lying on the right side of minus 8 is greater than minus 8. Similarly, 7 is greater than 6 as 7 lies on the right hand side of 6 and so on. Now how to represent rational numbers on a number line to compare? Let us represent the rational numbers between 0 and 1. For this, we divide the space between 0 and 1 in 8 equal parts. If we divide the space between 0 and 1 in 8 equal parts, it means we want to represent the rational number with the denominator as 8. Here we start from 0 moving towards the right side. So the first part is 1 by 8. Then we can put the next part 2 by 8, 3 by 8, 4 by 8, 5 by 8, 6 by 8, 7 by 8 and what is 1? It is 8 by 8 actually which after reduction changes to 1. Now let us see how to compare the rational numbers. Which is greater 3 by 8 or 5 by 8? Well 5 by 8 lies on the right side of 3 by 8. Hence 5 by 8 is greater than 3 by 8. So we can write 3 by 8 is less than 5 by 8. Now how to compare the rational numbers 5 by 7 and 2 by 7? Both of these lie between 0 and 1. So to show a rational number between 0 and 1 which has a denominator as 7, we divide the space between 0 and 1 in 7 equal parts. If we divide the space between 0 and 1 in 7 equal parts, starting from 0, moving towards the right at equal intervals, we can put 1 by 7, 2 by 7, then 3 by 7, followed by 4 by 7, 5 by 7, 6 by 7 and 1 which is actually 7 by 7. Let's see how to compare the rational numbers 5 by 7 and 2 by 7. Well, 5 by 7 lies on the right hand side of 2 by 7 and hence we can say 5 by 7 is greater than 2 by 7. Now, how to compare the rational numbers without using a number line? Remember the property of cross products or cross multiplication which we use to check if two rational numbers are equivalent or not. Here if a by b and c by d are two equivalent rational numbers then a multiplied by d would be equal to c multiplied by b which means if the two rational numbers are not equivalent then a multiplied by D is not equal to C multiplied by B. Now let's compare the rational numbers 3 by 8 and 2 by 7. Let's do the cross multiplication that is multiply the numerator of first rational number by the denominator of the second rational number. So 3 multiplied by 7 is equal to 21. Next, multiply the numerator of the second rational number with the denominator of the first rational number which is 2 multiplied by 8 and we get 16. We see 21 is greater than 16. What does it mean? It means 3 by 8 is greater than 2 by 7. Thus here we use the property of cross multiplication 
or the property of cross products to compare the two rational numbers. Now let us compare the rational numbers 3 by 8 and 15 by 40. Here we do the cross multiplication. 3 multiplied by 40 which is equal to 120. 15 multiplied by 8 which is equal to 120. So we see 120 is equal to 120 which says 3 by 8 is equal to 15 by 40 and thus these two numbers are equivalent rational numbers. Now let us compare the rational numbers minus 2 by 3 and 1 by 4. Let's do the cross multiplication again. So, minus 2 multiplied by 4 which is equal to minus 8 and 1 multiplied by 3 which is equal to 3. Minus 8 is less than 3. So, we can say minus 2 by 3 is less than 1 by 4. So, remember children, how to compare the two rational numbers? Using the property of cross products or cross multiplication, say A by B and C by D are the two rational numbers, then A by B is equal to C by D when A multiplied by D is equal to C multiplied by B. This means A by B and C by D are equivalent rational numbers. And when we compare the two rational numbers, say A by B and C by D, then A by B will be greater than C by D when A multiplied by D is greater than C multiplied by B. And lastly, while comparing the two rational numbers A by B and C by D, A by B will be less than C by D when A multiplied by D is less than C multiplied by B. So now you know how to compare the two rational numbers. That's all for now. Bye bye children.